Mastering graceful movements of the ballet to nature's own ballet mistress, the most delicate and lovely winged creature of them all, the butterfly. And here at the butterfly farm in Kent of lepidopterist Hugh Newman are specimens of the extremely rare Camberwell beauty, which he's obtained from America in the hope that they'll hibernate and breed in this country. The specimens, especially brought from America, Finland and Europe, are marked with a dye and spirit mixture so that they can be identified later as liberated butterflies and not the rare migrants. The first record of a Camberwell beauty in this country was in 1748, when one was seen fluttering at the window of a stagecoach in South London, hence the English name. But on the continent and in the United States, it's known as the morning cloak because of its colouring and appearance. The specimens to be liberated were imported by Mr. Newman because migrants, which he believes arrive in English ports from the holds of timber ships where they've been hibernating, are too few and probably of the same sex. In Greenwich Park, about 50 Camberwell beauties are released, concluding what is merely the forerunner of larger schemes in future years to introduce another